Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Sparkling Sense. It's Michelle here, your Sensi Gal. And it's been a while, I know I haven't been back, um, but I did come back uh, to uh, share with you the whip box for June. I know it's toward the end of the month, but um, you know, better late than ever. So uh, I just want to share with you what's going on with this whip box for June. And uh, at least uh, you still have time to get this whip box and uh, let's just dive on in so you can see what's in it, okay? So I'm going to just open it up and, and get right into it. If you can uh, see this here, what we have. Um, so uh, let's read this little pamphlet here. I just get this little pamphlet. It says, uh, with Fox, wander more, worry less. Has a little pelican on the front there. Um, so let's see. It says, your June with Fox is a curated collection of our on-the-go picks with fresh and fruity scents and an exclusive mini fan diffuser. Oh, that's really neat. So there's a, a mini fan diffuser in this. There's no telling where this summer will take you. Today's the day to say yes to new adventures. So I hope all of your summers are going well um, and starting uh, vacations and all that kind of stuff for the summer. So uh, let's see what we have here. So we do have a room spray in this whiff box. So this is called Sun Castles. And um, if you haven't known already that they did change the formulation of our room sprays. So we no longer have an oil-based room spray. This uh, formula is now a water-based room spray. So that uh, makes our room spray so much better. <clears throat> so uh, they're not slippery on the floors or anything like that anymore with the water base uh, solution now. So um, I'm liking the room, space, room spray so much better now. Uh, so if you haven't checked those out, uh, go ahead and check those out. Uh, let's see what we have else in here. Um, we also have, this is uh, one of our scent packs. Um, this is open air exploring. This um, Scent uh, was part of the Father's Day collection. Um, if you haven't seen that collection, you can check that out. Uh, gee, that was just last week. <laughs> how, how time flies. It, it goes by so fast. But this uh, scent pack, just so you know, these are used in obviously our uh, buddies that we have. Our scent buddies, they go in the back of the buddies. But these have scented beads in the back of them so with a little mesh packaging here but you do not have to just use these in the buddies so these are versatile you can use these in the uh in like your drawers in your closets um you can hang hang them because they have like a little um a uh, little like a ribbon tag here where you can put like a little string and hang it from your rear view mirror um i actually hang mine from i have a little hook in my garbage uh pail um, in the back and what I do is I I face this um, the pack like this way um, so that this mesh part is facing toward my garbage bag and um, this way when I put my garbage bag there it faces it so that um, I can have like some scent uh, in the garbage so that every time I open my garbage it'll it'll scent it so that's like another way that you can use it um, I have have them in my sheet drawer too, just so that they can scent my sheets too. Uh, so just there's you can use them like uh, also um, in a diaper pail bag. Um, there's so many different uses uses that you can use these. Uh, a gym bag, you know, you can hang them off some some a diaper bag if you wanted to. Um, but I know those diaper genies too. Some people like to um, put them at the top of those and and um, tape them up there and and in the top part you know you could do that so anyway just a bunch of different ideas you know that you can get out of those um, if you haven't thought of it <laughs> uh, but so that's in there um, okay so let's get to the um, exciting thing that's in here so this is the fan diffuser and I'm gonna open this one up mini fan diffuser this is a flamingo one so this is the exclusive product that's in the in this whiff box uh, let's see if I could get it open for you um, so excited to see this. Um, so this comes with a little USB um, cord that I dropped. And let's get started. 
started. Oh, oh, this is so cute. Look at this. Look at the little design and the colors. This is so colorful. This is actually adorable. Okay, so look at the look at all the pretty colors. Now this is obviously um, exclusive. This is the exclusive item for this Wiff box. So you can only get this in this Wiff box for this month. Um, we obviously have other fan diffusers um, within on the website in the catalog and, and so forth. But um, this one is exclusive. So you're not able to get this um, specific one, uh, Flamingo one, yet. Um, they um, may come out with it <laughs> uh, down the road, but um, for right now, you can only get it in the whiff box. Um, but you know how that goes. Sometimes they'll they'll bring it back another time, or maybe next summer, or something like that. Or you know, uh, you might have to wait for it. I don't know if they will. I mean, I'm just saying. But um, but if you really truly want it now. Um, you would have to just order the whiff box um, to get it, okay? Um, but this is actually so cute. I just really love the colors on it. Um, the And, well, I was going to say, well, I did just see something. Hold on, where did it go now? Oh, dang it. Oh, so you can see, like, the little, I thought it was looked like a, a full flamingo, but it didn't. It had, like, a little... <laughs> A little part of it but um so with this uh has pods so you, you know you don't want to have a mini fan diffuser without the pods of course so in the, in the box came two packs of pods so if you're not familiar with our pods um our pod packs come with uh two pods in them um each pack comes with two pods each um so what are pods are saying pods are just little round kind of things, I guess. <laughs> but they have scented beads in them also. And you probably are not going to be able to see the scented beads very well here. But there are scented beads in them. Okay. And um, let me just tell you what the names are. I didn't even get to tell you that. Oh, my God. I get so excited here. Um, so uh, By the Sea is uh, one of the names. This is more of a beachy kind of scent. And then... Um, Key lime and grapefruit is the other scent, and that one is uh, part of the summer collection. If you haven't had a chance to look at our summer collection, the summer collection I'm pretty sure is still available, and um, you might want to check that out on the website. But um, we had some really cool summer collection things, um, so you you might want to just take a, a gander at that. Uh, so let me tell you, or let me show you how this works, but. Oh, so this one, by the sea. Oh, that smells really nice. I got my fan on, so. Oh, it's it's like smelling. Oh, that does smell very more more beachy ish, beachy ish, I guess. And the key lime and grapefruit. Now, just so you know, I'm not big on grapefruit, probably because I don't like to eat grapefruit. I'm not a grapefruit fan as far as the fruit. But I do like the key lime. You can smell the grapefruit in it. Um, I'm not a fan of that, but but the key lime smells really nice. So with the mixture combined, it really doesn't smell bad with the grapefruit. Ooh, it does smell pretty. So let me just show you what you would do. This is so exciting. So our our um, mini fan diffusers are great because they come with the this USB, like I said, and you have um, the obviously the other end will connect into this uh, bottom piece here. And what you can do with this is I like these because these travel with you. I have one in my car, so I keep it in my car. So as soon as you plug it in to your little USB uh, part in your car, it automatically turns on. So um, this little fan inside, it'll circulate, and as soon as you put the pot in, it dis dis uh, the, <laughs> distributes or dis diffuses the, the, um, the scent beads, and then it circulates uh, the scent into the air. So um, <clears throat> these are great, like I said, for travel. So you can keep one in your car. You can pop one in to travel. If you're going somewhere, you can um, plug one into your laptop um, if you're at work or 
you know, just anywhere. If you're going to a hotel and you want to bring one with you to the hotel, you can have one in your hotel room. Um, just great to bring anywhere you want to have scent with you, you know. Um, so, um, so that's how you would use it with this. Um, what you can do, there is no uh, wrong or right way to put this um, pod in. So you can obviously sit it in this way, okay? Um, you can turn it around and put it in that way. That's the way I like to put it in. Um, I like it this way. I feel it's a little more sturdier. If you put it in this way, it's it's fine either way. Um, but what you can do too is um, there's a little label on here. Obviously, it gives you the name of the scent on here. So what you can do with this label is um, I'm going to give you a little tip here if I could find it. There is a little um, way that you can take the label off <clears throat> and put it on. I'll show you if I can if I can figure this out here. I don't know if it's going to let me do it. Yes, it is. What? Let's see if I could do it. Hold on. I'm, so find the little, um, find the little lip of the label. You're gonna take that label off, okay? You're gonna put your pot in. And then you're gonna take the label and and mine is lopsided, of course. And then you're just going to put the label right on top of it, center, and just come across it like that to the other end and just um, put it like that. So um, you could take the label off and just do that. And what that will do um, is it will just kind of hold it on there. Um, if mine is holding correctly. Um, I think because I put it on the on the ends where the little slats were, but you could put it on the section where there's no little like divots there. Um, but yeah, and then then it, if you um, a lot of people do that, especially if we have them in our car, um, we just do that just so that if if you're moving it and stuff, it won't fall off or fall out when you go to pick it up to move it around or something like that. So. Um, but that's just a little tip um, for you to um, have when you're, you know, moving it and stuff. So, um, yeah, and then um, that's just, just a little idea. Um, but that's how you could use it. But these are so great um, for travel. Um, they're great for cute little gifts and stuff like that. Uh, so that's um, just something that you would use. So we got that as an exclusive gift for this um, design and, and a colorful thing. Uh, let's see what else. So the two pod packs um, are great. Love it, love it, love it. And then we also did get, oh, oh, a wax bar. So the wax bar is um, uh, our, oh goodness, I can't speak today. This is Province Lavender, obviously purple wax here. And this is the scent of the month for um, July. Okay, so uh, it's coming up. Now, just I actually had this taken out, but you know that Scentsy always packages our wax um, during the hot, warmer um, summer months. Um, they use these like mylar, mylar pouches, and they usually come with these um, ice packs. And, you know, they always have like this little type sheath over the uh, ice packs and I actually like these ice packs because they're using these like gel ice packs and it has like this soft um, coating on it instead of that hard plastic but you can actually reuse these ice packs if you needed to like at home just freeze them and um, reuse them if you need to uh, what I do is I actually save these in a box um, throughout the summer and um, these packages and what I do is I actually donate them to my UPS store uh, I just bring them in a box after the summer's done when when they don't uh, send them to us anymore and I um, and then I go to my UPS store and I uh, bring them to them and say here you go if you can use these um, you know uh, 
you know, whenever they need to use them. And, uh, and then they take them and, and use them throughout the year if they need them. Uh, because I don't want to throw them out and there's not really somewhere I know that I can kind of recycle them. So um, it's just been a good um, relationship I have in my UPS store. I just bring them in. So that's just a little tip in case um, you're a consultant and you use those. Um, so anyway, back to our bar. So the scent bar is, um, like I said, Province Lavender. This is, um, if you have used our lavender scent before, there's one, the whipped um, vanilla one um, that we had out. Um, I thought that was a really nice scent. The, um, I think there was a lighter scent out called, what was it? The regu regular French vanilla, I think was a lighter scent. So this one is, um, this one seems stronger. This one's actually very nice. Ooh, this smells pretty good. Smells like straight lavender. This is really pretty. So the I did find the um, the scent. Oh, I probably have it on my nose. The scent um, notes to this. This was it's called Retreat to the Countryside and Linger While in Rolling Fields of Lavender. Lavender, and this is, um, Sensi had put this as a fresh category, but I think it's more kind of fresh and flowery, and I think it smells like, I think it smells like soap. <laughs> to me my nose I don't know if you'll think it smells like that but but that's what it smells like to me it is pretty now you all know probably have heard me say this before I think we had that lavender cotton that was in the laundry line and I did not like that lavender cotton in the laundry line um, I don't know what it was about that but the two mix the mixture I did not care for Oh, and I actually used it and washed my, my, I think I washed my sheets with it and I just did not like it, it was, to me it was like, a, I don't know, it was nasty. And I love cotton scents and clean cotton and all that kind of stuff. And I don't mind lavender, but that those two combined for some reason, just, I don't know, it just did not was for my nose was not the great combination, but this one smells really nice. But if you do if you don't like lavender, just lavender itself, you will not like this scent at all. Um, just like our other ones, like the vanilla lavender or the um, fresh lavender, <clears throat> you won't like it. But this one is really nice. Um, but I think this one was definitely a stronger scent. Um, so if, um, but this is coming out July. So for the scent of the month for July. Um, if you, if you like this, this is going to be the scent of the month. So, um, so with that being said, so for the whiff box, um, let me give you the total. So for the whiff box, um, you can still get this before the end of the month of June. So, um, you can order this individually. It's $35 plus tax and shipping. Um, if you order it individually, it's a $10, um, shipping. If you order it, um, through Scentsy Club, um, and put it in on a automated shipment, whether you're going to do it every month, every other month or every three months. And you want to get the whip box, um, you can do that. And it would be, um, $35 plus tax and shipping, but the shipping, you get like a discount. You, it's an $8 shipping. And then you get a 10% off the whip box if you do it in the club. And so your whip box, instead of $35, it would be $31 and 50 cents. Um, so you get the 10% off and then you get the $2 off the shipping. So that's a really good deal, I think. So I get mine in the club, of course. I mean, yeah, so I get it shipped every month. And um, so with the whiff box, so so you're getting the, our scent bars are $6. I'm going to give you the totals. The room sprays are $9. The 
uh, let's see, our scent packs are seven dollars. The uh, let's see, our Scentsy pods are ten dollars each, so you get two of these in each. Um, so that's ten. What are the, I'm counting, I added this up. So ten, it's twenty, got nine dollars. The scent pack, seven dollars. And then you're going to get the the fan diffusers are regularly fifteen dollars. Um, so, and of course this is exclusive, so um, only in the whiff box for this pattern. Okay. Um, so with that, the total for this whiff box is fifty seven dollars in full size products. So that's a really good deal. So. I technically paid $31.50 for this whiff box because I had it in the club because um, I got the 10% off. So, um, and all this equaled $57. So I thought that was a really good deal. Now, if you, it, you know, this the scent bar technically next month is $5.40 because you're getting the discount as a scent of the month. Um, but the bars regularly would be $6. Um, just kind of if you added that in there um and then i'm trying to think what other discounts and then if you have 60 dollars in your club um you could get the whiff box at half price so it would be like 17 dollars and 50 cents if you um so you could even get that at even a more discount if you had a sensi club set up and all that means is that you have um an account meaning it's just a password you know you set up a username and password that's all that means um, and it's free it's free to have the username and password set up and then you um, can adjust it as however you want you, know, you can set it up and have it once a month and then if you decide hey, I'm gonna change it and have it every other month or every three months and or however you want to do it back and forth. So uh, just to give you a little idea how that works and you can adjust it as however you want. Um, but yeah, so that's it. That's the whiff box. Um, you still have time to get it. So you still have up until, you know, midnight of the last day of the month. So um, it's available. Uh, so if, if you had gotten it and you love it and um, any comments, let me know. I, I, I enjoy hearing any comments. If consultants had, if you have gotten the whip box and you like it, let me know what your thoughts are on the scent um, or um, the pod scents or anything like that. If you like the room sprays and stuff, this water-based one. Um, I really like this colorful one, though, too. Um, I like that they're doing different uh, colors with the diffusers because you know I like the solid colors you know those can get boring though too sometimes <laughs> um, but the this is pretty colorful too um, so yeah check out our summer collection too and um, if you have any questions let me know and I'd love to hear from you so angel blessings I'll talk to you soon and uh, have a great day bye bye